up you guys? My name is Nkosi and thank you for coming back to my channel. If you're new, make sure you go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And while you're at it, go ahead and turn on my post notifications, which will notify you every single time I post a new video. So as you can read by the title, I'm going to be doing a mask talk once again. These videos have been very requested. Uh, these videos and story times, but I can't really do story times because my life is like a living... <laughs> like my life is so boring like I don't nothing exciting happens and every time something exciting happens I let you guys know so nothing in my life is popping right now um, so I have nothing to tell you guys so that's the reason why I'm not doing story times I can tell you old stories but like I said my life is boring so yeah like I said as you can read by the title I'm going to be doing a mass talk for you guys I'm going to be reviewing the Dead Sea Mud Pack by 7th Heaven. Um, I don't know if you can see it, but yeah, that's it. Um, very cheap. I don't know where I got it from. <laughs> I just found it. So, hey, I'm going to be reviewing it. Um, so yeah, let, let me just put it on and we could dig right into this mask talk. You guys know how it works. I put the mask on. I talk to you guys. I tell you my feelings. I tell you what's going on in my life. And yeah, we just talk for a few minutes. Yeah. And yeah, my sheets are white, so I hope I don't get anything on my sheets. Um, but, oh yeah, I hope you guys like the new background-ish. Um, I do have a room tour coming for you guys. I updated my room, if you haven't noticed yet. Um, I painted my walls white, and I added a few little things here and there. So, new backdrop is lit. Um, so yeah, stay tuned for a room tour that's coming very soon. Alright, so I am back with the mask, and right off the bat, I'm loving it already because it smells amazing. Like, this mask smells amazing. And my camera probably can't focus on me right now because I'm like literally, like, white face. Is this considered white face? <laughs> like, I really do think this is considered white face. Like, the camera is literally freaking out right now trying to focus on me. Um... How did I want to start this off? Well, first of all, where have I been? Where have I been? Where in the world is Aldo? Um, no, seriously, all jokes aside, where have I been? Uh, if you guys haven't noticed, um, I ain't that popping, so you probably haven't noticed, but I haven't been posting videos as much. Um, reason being is because not because I don't want to create content, don't get me wrong, it's not that I don't want to create content, I love creating content for you guys, um, and for myself, you know, but, um, I just haven't been motivated to create the content, um, that's why I haven't been, really been posting as much videos lately, and because I've been busy with work, uh, just working, and, like, when I come back from work, I just... You know, I'm, I'm tired, basically. Like, I'm, I don't have the energy to make a video. And the thing with me is, I started YouTube as... I For me, it's like, I never intended to make YouTube a... I have to do it this way, this way. Like, I have to, I have to, I have to create content. It's just that, at the time, I was just like, oh my gosh, I love making videos. Like, you guys were loving it. You guys were giving me feedback. Like, you know, so at the time, I was just posting, posting, posting. But now, it's just like, I'm not motivated. And it's just like, I, I don't intend to stop making the content. Don't get me wrong. It's not like, oh my god, I'm quitting YouTube. Like, I ain't clickbaiting you guys. But... Just don't expect me to be posting as much as I used to. Um, reason being, like I said, it's just like I'm not motivated to create the content. You know, like, and for me, it's like I don't want to make YouTube a thing where I have to make a video. Like, I don't want to sit down and force myself to make a video. You feel me? For me, I want YouTube to be a creative outlet for me. Like when I when I want to make a video and when I want to be creative, I can make these videos. Like really and cozy, putting on a mask and talking to your camera is creative. But you guys get what I'm saying. Like I I just don't. How can I put it? I'm just not motivated. Just put it that way. I'm not motivated. I'm not gonna stop. The grind never stops. But. The, the grind is just slowing down a bit. You know, you feel me? I just need that that fuel to rejuvenate me. And it's coming. I promise you it's coming. 
Um, which brings me to my next topic. Um, I, every time I talk about it, I just get so happy. Um, I look so ugly right now, but whatever. Um, I am in the process of making my own music. Uh, and if you don't follow me on my social medias, which you should be already, um, you can follow me on Snapchat, Instagram, Twitter, all in the same place at one time. So yeah, if you follow me on all of my social medias, you know that I'm in the process of making my own music. My own music, just 100% me. I wrote it, I didn't produce it, though I got a producer to make it, but um, wrote it, I'm going in the studio, literally, I'm filming this now, I'm going in the studio tomorrow tomorrow night um, to record it. Um, for me it's just like I've waited so 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 long for me to finally release my own music um, and it's finally here like and I haven't even released this song yet like let alone recorded it yet and I'm like on top of the world. So could you imagine like once I finally release it? Um, I have big plans for you guys. Like I have big, like I have so many ideas. I don't want to tell you the ideas um, just yet, but I have so many ideas for this song. Um, it's going to be big. It's, I, I think it's going to be really big for me and, my, and the start of my career. Um, it, it, it's yeah it's just gonna be amazing I'm taking you guys along with me on this journey I'm actually gonna be recording the um, studio process so keep an eye out for that but yeah just just know that my music is coming and Kosi is in full force you feel me um, and also because the thing about music is creating music takes time it takes time it takes energy it takes money it takes coin like, you can't just walk up into a studio for free and be like, listen, record my track, mix it, master it, boom, done. Like, it doesn't work like that. And that's the reason why it's taken me so long. Not, well, part of it being money-wise and part of it being, it takes time. Like, I just don't sit down, write a song, okay, done, let's record it. Like, and for me, it's just like, I don't want my music, because I can record it on GarageBand and, like, easily put it together and drop it on SoundCloud. But I don't want it to be like that. And a lot of artists do that these days. And that's cute for you or whatever, but for me, like, I'm trying to make a career out of this. So I need to put that time, that money, and that effort into what I want to release. You feel me? Like, it's a lot of money. Like, not expensive, but it, it, it costs money to be in a studio. It costs money to make, you know, music like that. Um, so I've sacrificed a lot for this and it's gonna happen so that's that on that I'm gonna leave that topic um moving on to my mouth literally my mouth um <laughs> I've noticed a lot and I've been told that I curse a lot in my videos not a lot but I I, I have a vulgar mouth and I'm, I'm I'm stopping that like immediately um I can't promise you that every video is gonna be <laughs> you know, clean, but it's definitely going to be down to the bare minimum. Um, simply because of the fact that if I want to make this a business and make this, you know, what I want to do with my career, eventually, then I, you know, I can't really be cursing like that on YouTube. Because now YouTube is like really cracking down on, you know, what they want to make money like people to make money off of so like ad, people who want their ads on your video they don't want you know cursing you know vulgar language and all that they're not gonna put their ads on your video if your video you know has cursing and nudity you guys know the basics so for me to make money I need to bring my cursing down to the minimum if not I need to bleep it which I started doing like at the beginning like I started bleeping my curse words but it's girl. It started getting to the point where I was just like, "This is draining me." Like, I don't want to sit there. I was like, you know, cursing like a like a, a sailor. Like, so I don't I don't want to sit there every video and just bleep out every word. It get it's boring. Yeah. So from now on, mark my words. Don't mark it a hundred percent, but I will definitely be bringing my cursing down to like a minimum 
Uh, so yeah. Because I notice like a lot of, not a lot, but most young people watch me. Like I looked at my analytics and I have some people who are very young watching me. <laughs> so it's just like, oh girl, your mama lets you watch me? <laughs> like little old me, you're watching me? Your mama needs to recheck her life. <laughs> like, no, just checking. But um, yeah, so that's that on that. Um, just a life update in general. Um, like I said, I've been working a lot, a lot, a lot. Um, what else? I've just been working. I've been saving the coin, saving up the coin because as you guys, well, if you don't know, which you probably don't know, but I've taken a gap year, which is a break off of college. Um, I am, I w I did complete my first year, made it onto the vice principals list, which is amazing. I passed my first year of college with flying colors, which I am very grateful for. Um, so at the moment, I am taking a gap year, just taking a break, little hussa, recollect my thoughts, recollect my energy, because college drained the crap out of me. Um, but yeah, so at the moment, I'm just working, saving the coin up um, to move to the States, which I am so excited for. I'm moving to Philadelphia with my family. Out with that I have out there um, so I'm excited I'm going to Temple University I'm going to be studying film and media arts um, which is basically editing filming producing pre-production production post-production post all of that editing and filming that's the the path that I want to go down and it's funny because I started like when I was young I wanted to be a direct a movie director um, and I was just telling everybody, oh, I'm going to be this big movie director, I'm going to make all the big movies, yeah, yeah, yeah. Not that I want to do that now, I don't really want to go down the path of the director, per se, um, per se but um, I definitely want to be in that film genre, not really a genre, but you, you get that, that field, that's what I want to say, I want to be in that film field. Um, yeah, that's what I love to do. And obviously, I'll be doing my music on the side. Like, I don't really want to just go to school for music. You feel me? So, yeah, that's exciting. Um, I definitely want to, I don't know, I want to work on a, a big project before I leave Bermuda. Like, I, I don't know if I, if it wants, if I want to do, like, a music video for one of my songs or... I definitely want to do a music video, but I don't know if it was I want to do like a short film, like something big that's going to like leave my mark. Because I feel like I haven't left my mark. Like I feel like not much people know about me and they, not in a cocky way, I don't want to say, but I feel like they need to know about me. You know, like these, some, most people need to know about me in Bermuda and it's, it's hard being a creative person in Bermuda because it's just like, not much people support it. You feel me? And if they're not related to you, or if they don't know you, like, so much people have so much pride, too much pride in Bermuda. So, like, they don't want to support the people who deserve the support. I'm just going to put it that way. I'm not going to say anything by throwing shade. I ain't going to throw shade in this video, but people support what they want to support. Put it that way. Um, but for me, it's just like, that's why I'm making my own music now, and once I release it, I know... I know it's going to get the attention that it deserves. And I'm not just saying that to toot my own horn, but that's just that belief that I have and that courage within myself and that confidence. I know my music is going to take me somewhere, like beyond Bermuda. Because, um, I mean, that's just not what I want. I don't want to make music and then just be big in Bermuda. You feel me? Like, what is that getting you? Like, what is, what do you obtain like what are you receiving from that like island-wide popularity like I mean that's cute or whatever but you ain't gonna live off this world just being cute so I need to go bigger and better which is what I'm doing um so yeah a lot of people like to tear my name down um I ain't gonna dig into that but if you're watching you're watching because I know that person watches my videos um, but this is pretty much dry. I've been chatting to you guys for about 15 minutes. And I'm pretty sure you've had enough of my mouth. So, I'm gonna go wash this off and I'll be right back. Alright, so I am back. My face is rejuvenated. That mask was alright. I mean, it smelled good. It made my face feel, you know, soft. 
um, it did dry my face out a little bit, so I had to like put my um, uh, moisturizer on. Uh, but I mean, it was all right. I'll give it a cute little seven, eight and a half out of ten. So yeah, that's it for today's video, guys. I really hope you enjoyed it. And if you did, go ahead and give it a big thumbs up. I would really appreciate it. Also, all of my social medias will be down in the description box below for you guys to go ahead and check out. And as always, until next time, see you later.